So a lot of people have been asking me how we've been finding the eye candy peach blossom. So when we actually received the pushchair, I did film myself putting it together. And as you can see, when you get out of the box, you will need to add the rear wheels to the pushchair. You can lock and swivel the wheels using the catch on the front, as was just a little bit stiff. To use in the actual twin mode, you do need to put the adapters under the seat, which I haven't done here, but I will do slightly later on in the video. The handle adjusts really easily by pushing the button right in the centre of the bar. And here I am just popping the rain cover on to show you how it fits. It is really easy. I do make it look a bit more difficult than it actually is, but the plastic kept sticking to the metal, so just work it over like this and hook it over, and actually it does only take seconds to put on. And probably in real life you wouldn't attach the Velcro around the handles, so it is a matter of about 10 seconds to put it on. The brake is just at the centre of the rear wheels there. I'll just say this is by no way a professional demonstration of how to put the eye candy peach blossom together or how to use it, it is just how I did it. So here are the risers for the seat to convert the pushchair into the sort of twin mode and the adapters for the rear car seat as well. So they attach to the frame of the pushchair, these are for the maxi cosy, I'm not actually sure if it's the same for all types of car seats or just for the maxi cosy. So that is what I'm using here. And as you can see now the seat has got the risers um, on and has made it high enough that we can now fit the car seat underneath and we can move two babies around and I really love this pushchair. So simple to push.